Hello, what's up? It's a beatbox reaction, but you already knew that because you already clicked here. And of course, things always fucking go wrong. So my mic didn't work. It did for like months. And then right now it just didn't. So hopefully it's working. I don't know until I check the actual footage. This is not what you requested. So I mean, tough shit. The video that was requested, no one's, no one's watching it. I can't really react to shit that no one's watching. Can I? Anyways, this is Wing. It says from South Korea. Of course, all Asian beatboxers make me very uncomfortable. Not because they're Asian, but because them motherfuckers copyright everything. Like everything. Like the footage, the sound, the copyright everything. But whatever. I will have high hopes. High hopes that there's not a bunch of copyright shit. And uh, it's been a long time. Let's watch a wild card. Can we? It's Wing from South Korea, and this is my solo wildcard for GBB 2023 World League. Oh, eyes! All right, his melody's good. You're like, how can a melody be good where it's only got like two or three notes? Because your melody kind of reflects what you're working with, and so even if you have like one unexpected note in the melody. That means you're probably going to do something interesting with the rest of what you got. Back up. Word leak. Hey. Please don't make me stuck in a misery online. I am nothing, just nothing. Grab Sonic, swing the beer. Seems like I've been. The melody is very, 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 very good. I might have to like break out a guitar on that shit. I am nothing, just nothing. Grab Sonic, swing the beat. So right there when he goes, but da 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 uh, but da na 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 na. He's he's outlining chord changes, right? Because there's only so many notes that belong in a chord. I mean, obviously you could bullshit your way and say every note belongs in every chord, but that's not true. So well, fuck it. Go ahead and get mad. Go ahead and get mad. Go ahead and leave. I'll give you a second. So let's say. That's very clear. That's like maybe the most clear separation of chords you can have. This is where we are. That's usually like a, a dominant chord. It's like a it's it's almost as far away as you can get. I know the notes are next together, but notes that are next together when it comes to chords typically makes them the furthest apart. Because chords that are similar share notes. And one note apart is the opposite of sharing notes. It's very much a clash. To what? Right? to build melodies. Seems like I've been back up, back up. Me zooming online. I am nothing, just nothing. Grab Sonic, swing the beer. Seems like I've been abandoned by gun. There's the chords. Oh, I gotta hear this again. Because now he's using the single notes in the bass line. And then he's got arpeggios when he goes up. And he's doing like little fills at the top. So he's got the bass line implying 
Root movement. I forgot this is what it's like to talk to y'all. Root movement, like the, the lowest sounding pitch you hear. Um, you call it root, root movement. It's not always the root. It's the lowest sounding note, which gives you an idea of what's going on chordally. And then there's the actual rest of the pitches that help you get an idea of the chord that's actually happening. And then the rhythm. But the rhythm is not, I mean, the rhythm is catchy. I'm saying for analysis purposes. A catchy rhythm is not really important for analysis. It's good for listening. Right? It's like a, it's like a slice, like a vertical slice is everything that's going on harmonically. And when you take a vertical slice, there's not rhythm in a vertical slice because it's one chop. Seems like I've been up in the bacon. Oh, he's right there. Do, 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 do. Uh, where's my voice? I can't sing. Do, 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 do. See, even that, he's do, 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 do. That's the far away chord. Do. And that's the home chord. Oh, I think you hear what he's doing. He's he's uh, doing two high notes. Pause, one high note. Two high notes. Boom. Dot. Uh, oh, I can't do no falsetto. Do, 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 do. So that's now that's the arrangement of of the notes. I mean, he's sticking with the one high note, two high notes. He's changing up the texture, but basically his arrangement is the low bass note, boom, boom, right? And then one high note, two high notes. He's getting more fancy with it, but it's still the basics. He's sticking with that structure. <laughs> Okay, now that's where it changes up because now he did two every time on top and then had three notes on top. Oh God, uh, it's like a pedal tone. That's what's going on on the top, and the bass note's changing. Oh, he's going down the whole time, but it's a boom, boom, boom. Oh, I think I think that's pretty close. It's like all right. Ah, ah. I didn't go for that far enough. So 
So it's maybe he's like. And you can't keep the pedal tone top. Oh, whoops. Where's it? Right. Again, we get. D minor. I mean, I could be off with the key center, but it's still basically working from D minor all the way down to A major. It's still tonic, D minor, dominant, or five seven chord. And if you're in the, if you're in the key of D minor, your five chord is A seven. I mean, it's actually A minor if you're playing like strictly in the key, but typically in a minor key, you would make your five chord major. So instead of A minor 7, it's going to be A major 7. So this is D minor is the key. We have a linear bass line. And then it goes back up. And then we have our little lick, right? Um, oh, where? I guess that's what y'all want to know. I mean, shit. It's been a long time since we talked about it. Back up. And boom. What? No. Here. Oh, that like that walk up is. So now he's taken his uh, the top two notes he's played. He's moved them up. I don't think an octave, but he's moved them up. So it's still the same structure, repeating notes on top. But now he's for for variety. He's moved those two notes on on top. He's moved them higher up. I don't think he went up an octave. I don't think there's any point in trying to, to do it. So instead of uh, if it wasn't an octave, right? Instead of then an octave up would it be? So I don't think I don't think it went that high. Right, I don't think it went that high. I'm not gonna figure out the notes. I mean, you get the idea. Oh, he went back to two notes, one note, two note, one note. Boom, ba -doo -doo -doo. And he jumped up. I can't. My voice can't go that high. So he went. He went from having two notes, one note, two note, one note, where they were kind of similar notes. And he went from two note, one note, and then his one note was higher. So he like do 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 do. Oh, and then, okay, that's displacement. So in that, uh, displacement is where you take a note you would typically expect, and you basically play the same note, but you change the register where it's at. 
So, uh, uh, I don't know if I can demonstrate it. So if the high note is, let's say I'm up here. If I take it up an octave, that's an octave displacement up. And if I take it down, is right? So you get like a mixture. Oh, I missed. So he's kind of like, it's the same idea. He's just bouncing around the registers. Displacement. At least that's what I was told it was called. You're displacing the expectation of where you expect that note to be. So if you're expecting an A at a certain register, you play an A higher or lower. And of course you have the entire freedom of your vocal range to ch change how far away that is. And then you can really get nuts and you can start displacing a bunch of different things. It's all, I don't know, to me it's like math. Oh, I like him going on and up. Bow, bow, bow. I just think that's a strong rhythm to end on. Back up. Ah, oh, it's a great rhythm to end. Boom, da dum, boom, ba dum, boom, ba dum, boom, ba dum, boom, da dum, boom, do boom, boom, boom. That's the rhythm, right? Isn't that right? Oh, boom, da ka da, da, boom, da ka da, da, boom, da ka da, boom, ba, 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 boom, boom, boom. That's just a strong rhythm. I think I got that right on the first try, right? Boom, da ka da, da, boom. Notice in the last one he went boom da 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 boom boom boom. So it's like syncopated and then it's straight laced for like four notes and then boom 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 boom. I can't I can't do it without rhythm. Boom da ka do ka do ga boom. That's that's gotta be it. Oh, bon, 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 bon. Yeah. We'll see if you guys still like this shit. It's been a long time. We'll see if you still like it. Deuces.